fellow space engineers. I guess it's time for another episode. So, what am I doing? I'm out here mining. I was just uh, figuring out a way to mine this place. So I flew out here and I'm gonna start picking this stuff up as I talk. It's gonna be very distracting. So I don't have any plans for today other than to mine. I'm gonna be mining and then I'll probably go over to the graveyard and I'll probably take apart a ship or two. Um, with this larger inventory I find, I find you can do a lot of this stuff a lot more. Uh, the, the grinders on the ship all, are, are almost unnecessary, uh, but it would still speed up things. So, I don't know. I like the realistic settings personally, but I do like the the expanded room as well because the, the volume on the ships and everything is increased as well. Eh, it's not bad. Everything else is unrealistic. Uh, I've maintained uh, at least the refinery and the assembler settings. Let's go take a look here. Underneath our ship here. So this might be a boring episode, I have no idea. And that's fine and dandy. So I'm just gonna put this stuff right into the refinery. Here we go. Yeah, so... Yeah. I don't mind the realistic settings in, uh, you know, in this thing. I find it goes pretty quick anyhow, because you should be out doing other things other than building sometimes. I think you, you know, we should be out gathering and all that fun stuff. Uh, just looking at my iron, got a lot of iron it's in, the, in the assembler, I think. Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. Yeah, because I was putting the iron in here because I was going to build stuff, and I think I need to make... Let's make uh, two, three, five. See if I have enough. Oh yeah, yeah, I got plenty. So we'll do that while we're okay. Uh, I unloaded, and let's see what I've been doing. I'll show you how I've been mining this. Uh, you'll see how I'm facing up here, because I'm kind of digging up here, in here, and it all seems to be falling. Okay, good. So it's falling where I expect it to go. Excellent. So yeah, so I've been mining in here. And we're going to take a look at how this works. And I'm trying not to say um, and I, I don't know if I am aware of it or not. <laughs> so, but let's just start mining. I usually line up and then I go into the cockpit. It seems to be easier to do mining, all mining from the cockpit. And here we go. Notice, we're fast enough. Uh, <laughs> everything's dropping basically behind the ship, so which is at the bottom of the the cave, uh, well, cave asteroid or whatever you want to call this big, huge chunk of resource in space. So I've been just doing this, filling up. Da -da 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 -da. Whoa, what's going on here? This is the thing with mining, is it moves you around, and I don't know if I like that, but yeah, that's fine. Let's get some uranium. This is the, the point of this, is get a bunch of uranium. I need to fill up the ships with this stuff. It's like a fuel, it's like a drug. It's pretty funny. The solar panels work. I find that they're, they're pretty good. I just don't know of a practical application in them. Uh, I think you've somehow building a way of being able to protect them. So I know there's the motors in the game, right? That you can use, I think, or have. I'm gonna have to look. At, let's see here. Uh, yeah, I can't look in here. Uh, let's take a hop out. Take a look, quick look. I know. See, there's the. Where is it? There's warheads. So I figured out why the warheads possibly blow up. I think it's. It's when they're attached to thrusters, or their or thrusters are are in front of them. I don't know. Maybe they just I don't know. I'm gonna have to you, play with these one day and see what they do. Uh, but otherwise, yeah, they have the curved conveyor belt now. That's kind of cool. What was I going in here for? I was gonna show something. Erg. See, I get distracted like that. That's terrible. Oh yeah, yeah, the rotors. <clears throat> Here we go, these things. These you can turn on and off, so I want to play with these. 
at some point. Uh, I just said, um, haha. I want to play with these somehow so that way you can create maybe uh, like a pa like a whole bunch of solar panels and then you frame them and then create this mechanical device that that can cl open and close them is what I'm thinking and uh, I'm gonna do it for a station I believe and I'm thinking you can move these stations if you put thrusters on them but I don't know because I haven't seen any other let's plays or anything like that and I'm just curious about that. So I do plan on building a space station of some sort that will be able to be manipulated. Because if that's the case, then I have a big plan for that. Um, massive, massive plan for that, I guess. Well, I don't know. I don't know if it's massive, but in my mind it is. And it, it should be exciting to build. But yeah, but that will be you know, down the road. Right now we're, we're worried about the big ship, but I want to play with these missile turrets and stuff and put those on the big, big ship. I uh, definitely want some of that stuff to happen at some point because I think it'd be fun to shoot the old ships apart or you know, try to retrofit these old ships and then just have fun with them, I think. I think that'd be cool because we're YouTubing this stuff and we could do some cool things like that. <laughs> but that'd be down the road. That's kind of just some ideas I've got floating around. And let's get back to some mining here, some serious mining. Collecting fuel, other important resources. So what I'll do is I'm going to you carry on a drilling here. And then I'll come back right after I'm done the drilling here to show you what happens next. Alrighty, right on. So I'll be right back. Well, yeah, here we go. So. <clears throat> this is what's happening now. So what I usually do is I usually drill for a bit. I'll fill this up a bit. Woo! <laughs> I've been drilling longer than I thought I've been doing. Okay. So yeah, so basically I'll drill, 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 drill. And then I'll pop out. And then I'll come down here. Let's see what's going on here. Sometimes stuff falls in weird spots. See, I'll like go over. Yeah, saving over here see look at this stuff this stuff got stuck in here somehow all this resources let's see if I turn off my jetpack okay I'll be thinking out loud so I apologize if it's gonna be weird but I think I need to do that to stay focused so let's see raw thought process here right <laughs> uh, I've been kind of thinking about the idea of the base and I want to make it cool so it should be yeah i don't really want to talk about it too much because it's kind of ideas i don't know if someone else has done it out there you know what maybe i'll do i'll talk about it a little bit just to kind of get the concept idea so basically space stations are supposed to be huge right well i have my ship then i have the larger ship that i'm going to build well this space station i want to be able to handle that big huge ship that i'm building is my idea and in that sense the big huge ship I'm building is going to be docked with it, it won't actually be landed inside so uh, the base will be uh, I believe large but not too big right it's, it still has to make sense it's still in space but it's gonna be cool I think I think it's gonna have to be a really cool structure I want to put some cool designs on the outside of it I just want to make it really cool and I want to do it all by hand. That's kind of the goal of this, is to do it all by hand. So building that large ship the way I am is kind of an, a plan for the bigger, bigger project I want to do. So, and I want to do it all by hand just to, to show you that it's kind of like an evolutionary process and to have all of you people just kind of watch and you know, see how it happens. Um, I'm not going to show every detail, of course, just like as I mentioned. But I think if I have something to talk about, I'll show you. So this is kind of what I do the days I don't record. I'm out here doing this kind of stuff. So let's see here. I don't know why I tab push the tab there. And so what I do is I mine for a bit. I usually have my ship out here with the gravity generator. I get it as close as I can. I found this cool 
you know, um, asteroid or I don't I don't know what to call these big rocks. I think because there's terminology for it, and I I think it's like it's asteroids, and then there's mini asteroids. The mini asteroids are the little tiny ones which don't have resources in them. It seems, and then these are the asteroids, the big ones with the resources. So, anyways, I come out here and I pick this stuff up after I drill for a bit. This is the next phase of what I'm doing today. And basically I'm going to carry on with this until I'm, full, I'm uh, filled up with my my small mining ship. And then I, I start to empty it. So basically I'll probably do one more load of this stuff. And then we'll fly back to... Uh, yeah. Just thinking here. And then maybe we'll fly back to the graveyard and I'll... I'll show you how I tear apart my ships. I do a little bit of boat. Well, I don't know. I don't know if you need to see that. That's probably pretty boring. I'll tell you what. This is not going to be too long, I guess, of an episode. It's just kind of showing what I'm doing today. Kind of my thought process on the the large ship, the astro or the, uh, the the space station I want to do as well, and and you just the idea of implementing weapons at some point. Because I do imagine that we'll want to have some fun and shoot some stuff up just to see how that stuff works. So I definitely want to see how that works. I want to see how the, the machine gun works as well. That I got out of a ship one time. I want to, you definitely, you try that. Just, just see. Because if you don't know what it's like, then you don't know if it's going to be fun or if they need to work on it. I know it's very basic, rudimentary, and they, you need a lot of work. Cause I just feel that we walk around it's almost better to create a gravity field wherever you're building and to run around and to to do things that way it just seems like it's more efficient that way so it's just weird unless that's by design uh, that's why the gravity generators take so much I'm not sure but yeah but I'm definitely enjoying this game I'm definitely enjoying the fact that I can run around just mine and do some cool stuff like that I do want to revamp my ship, <laughs> the mining ship, because it's kind of, I need to find places like this. This area is perfect for my mining ship because it's easy, it's, it's really curved around and I can just start digging and attacking this and everything will drop into a big container here and then I can pick it up. It's not, and it doesn't really scatter around too much, so yeah. Oh yeah, so stuff does fall down into here, okay crap oh that's okay though that's from up top up above yeah see the gold right there so I can definitely mine that freely and rest assured that's gonna land in here okay I'll tell you what I mean, all of you out there have a great day um, I'll probably make another episode when I'm at the ship uh, you're building that so yeah so I hope you enjoyed this short episode here just a little bit about what's happening today, the mining, the plans, all the dreams in this game. And yeah, we'll see how that goes. So thank you. You all have a great day and have a great day building. <laughs>